Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Hachi and I live in Japan. So in this video, it's a little bit different from my usual video because I'm dressed in this Japanese high school uniform to celebrate Halloween this year. And also, I'm going to introduce you guys Japanese convenience store sweets that is related to Halloween. And I hope you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video and also comment anything to support me so I can make more contents for you guys to watch. <laughs> actually a collaboration with Pierre Pierre Hermé and this is how it looks like cute little man right here <laughs> and I, I think it looks like tiramisu because they're chocolate what is this chocolate ganache <laughs> and then some crumbles and then cream and maybe this is the marrow I'm not sure but let's eat it and try it Going deep down so that I can get a piece of everything. Mm. Oh my gosh. This tastes so good. It tastes like those dessert that comes out from a expensive restaurant after their main course. It's so good. So this cookies and the chocolate and the cream and the maroon, everything just blends so well with each other and it's actually not too sweet. The one thing that I don't really like about Japanese sweets is because I think they're actually pretty sweet in my opinion. But this is actually not that sweet. It has little hints of the bitterness from the chocolate and also the sweetness from the cream and also the crunch from the crumbles. It tastes amazing. Mmm. I can totally finish this myself. I'll rate this a 4 out of 5. It's really that good. No, 4.5 out of 5. The second thing I'm going to try is this pumpkin pudding. Well, Halloween is always related with pumpkin, isn't it? Because of the jack o' lantern. It smells like pumpkin. <laughs> like the uh. So it looks like this. I wonder what's below here. So let's eat. Wow. Mmm. It has a very strong pumpkin taste and a very strong pumpkin smell. So if you're not really a pumpkin person, this might be too strong for you guys and it's a little bit sweet for me but even though it's from the convenience store but you can actually taste real pumpkin so I think it's not just like pumpkin powder or pumpkin extract it's really one whole pumpkin in this dessert Well, I'll give this a 3.5 out of 5, maybe. I don't hate pumpkin, but I'm not really a pumpkin person. So, yeah, I'll give it 3.5 out of 5. But I can't stop eating it. <laughs> oh, it actually tastes a bit like cream brulee because this dark color below is the sugar, just like those you find in creme brulee. So, I think this is the creme brulee flat. This is the pumpkin version of creme brulee. Well, it's not my favorite, but it's pretty good. Let's go to the next one. Souffle pudding. 
how do you pronounce it in English? Souffle. Because in Japanese it's souffle. Souffle pudding. Right above it's souffle, <laughs> and below is the pudding, obviously, because it's called pudding. I'm not actually a souffle, a big fan of souffle, but let's try this. It's actually quite big. Mm. So in Japanese, I would describe this as fua fua, which means fluffy. Because the pancake on top is really fluffy, and then the pudding. The pudding tastes so good. I prefer the pudding better than the pancake. <laughs> I guess we're supposed to eat it together. Like this, one big mouthful. Mm. It tastes better when you really dig in and then you put a big mouthful in it so you can get a piece of everything. I'll rate it a 3 out of 5 because I'm not really a super fan, a pancake fan, but this is pretty good. I really love the pudding below because it's, it tastes very creamy, very thick, and actually not too sweet. I would probably eat the pudding below and then I'll leave the super for my husband. <laughs> so the fourth I'm eating is this Chiffon, kuchidake no ii cream to kocha kaoru fuwari chiffon. It's chiffon cake. And it says kocha, which means. What's kocha in English? Kocha. Red tea. Oh. Looks like this. The cream on top is so cute. It's It looks like the poo. <laughs> A poo emoji? Yeah, it looks exactly like it. <laughs> oh, it's not hard. So it's chiffon and this poo cream. Gonna dig in. Oh! It's basically just chiffon cake. Like, it, it doesn't look special. Let's taste it. It's nothing special to me. It's just normal chiffon cake. Maybe personally, I'm not a chiffon person either. I'll rate this a 2.5 out of 5. And this is too sweet for me. For me, I don't like it. 2.5 out of 5. And the fifth dessert I have here is this tiramisu. Puchi tiramisu. Puchi means tiny or small. So this is like a tiny tiramisu. I actually got this not from the convenience store, but supermarket. I was so craving for a tiramisu and then I saw this little tiramisu and I was like, oh, I have to get it. And it has this pumpkin, jack-o'-lantern. Perfect for Halloween. I actually... I think I've had it, I've had this before and I pretty enjoyed it. Okay, I'm a little fool from all the sweets. Wow, it is so. Actually, I don't think this is a Halloween sweet because I've seen this like a few months back before but actually all these Halloween sweets are from my husband I actually requested my husband to buy it for me because I'm too lazy to go out of the house 
so I requested him to go to the convenience store before coming back home to get me all this Halloween sweets. So I think he thought this is a Halloween sweets because of packaging. It's cute though. Thank you, hubby. Ah, it's a creep like this. Don't worry, I've washed my hand already, so it's squeaky clean. Looks like this. Mmm. It has real chocolate inside. And the chocolate is, I think they use dark chocolate because it's not too sweet. And also there's a little cream around it. So with the dark chocolate and the cream and also this creep it actually gives very good texture and the creep is actually pretty chewy i think i like this it's not too sweet hmm i like this hmm i'll give this a four out of five You don't have to go to Harajuku for their super expensive creep. You can just go to Sony 11 and get this. And I think this tastes better. And it's just 170 yen. And the one selling in Harajuku is like 500 or 600 yen. Okay guys, I'm getting full. <laughs> okay guys, I've tried all six sweets from the convenience store. If I were to choose one for the champion, it would be from 7-Eleven, which is a collaboration with Pierre Hermé. I wish they have this collaboration forever, so I can get it whenever I want it. Mmm! Because it's really that good. Maybe because it's a collaboration with Pierre Hermé. Oh, it's so good! I think I can finish this all by myself. And I will leave all the remaining ones for my husband because some of them are too sweet for me. And I'm gonna have this all for myself. <laughs> so that's all for my video today. I hope you enjoyed watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe and like and comment down below what you think of this video. And I hope you have a nice day, have a nice Halloween and see you on my next video. Bye!